The difference between coaching in college in the NFL today, as opposed to when you did it, is what? You know, Dan, uh, uh, not too awful long ago, uh, Terry Bradshaw asked me on the show, he said, what's the difference in college coaching and pro coaching you know, and, and, and coaching the game? I said, you know, Terry, there's not a world of difference. There's a galaxy of difference. <laughs> It, it, it you really you can't compare it, it i mean i could go on and on and on you know, if you're in one of the top 10 programs uh, in college football uh you know the difference in the talent is so vast uh you're going to win 10 games just by showing up uh so a lot of times it, it's hard to evaluate a college coach going into pro football the other thing is you know as opposed to grown men that are working for a living you know, in college, you're a mentor, you're a father figure, you know, they're young kids that left home for the first time in their life. You know, they've got all kinds of problems, girlfriend problems, academic problems, you know, they're homesick. And so you end up spending half your time counseling them. Uh, in professional football, they're grown men working for a living. You know, they have a job. Uh, and how well you do uh, depends on how much money they're going to make. Uh, so, you know, they're a little bit more skeptical than a, a 18 year old kid, the length of the season on, oh, like I said, I could go on and on and on. You know, the, I, I remember when Steve, Steve Spurrier went to uh, the Redskins. Um, he said, okay, he looked at the practice fields and he said, well, this is the offensive practice field. He said, is that the defensive practice field down there? They said, Hey, you only got 53 players. We don't have, we don't have enough players to have two, you know, two groups going. It's not like college where you've got a hundred players. Uh, but, but there's a world of difference between the two.